From insects, reptiles and fish to the world's biggest lizard, here are 15 real life dragons. Number 15, Dragon Snake. Since dragons have sometimes been described as humongous snakes, we felt we had to include this reptile. It's native to Malaysia and Indonesia, where it's also known as the Javan mud snake. They measure about two feet long and were so named for the black scales that run down their body. Even though they were first discovered in the 1800s, not much is known about them even today. Number 14, Chinese Water Dragon. These lizards are native to the mainland of Southeast Asia and China. They can grow more than three feet long, one meter, with the tail accounting for two thirds of its total body length. The animal can use its tail for several uses. That includes swimming and balance, as well as using its tail as a weapon. Experts say they try to avoid confrontation whenever possible. At the first sign of a threat, the critter will drop from the trees into the water, where it can stay underwater for about 90 minutes. They're pretty docile for dragons and are popular in the exotic pet trade. Number 13, Dragonette. In some mythologies, dragons are linked to the water, so you'll find a few of their aquatic namesakes on the list. This one is a tropical fish that's found in the waters of the Indo-Pacific. They're known for having long, scaleless bodies and prominent fins and spines. Their name implies that they're little dragons, and the Mandarin Dragonette matches that description. These animals really stand out thanks to their vivid coloration and patterns which have a psychedelic look. Number 12, Seeing Red Dragons. Some legends depict dragons that are coloured red and are called fire dragons. We couldn't find a fire dragon, but we did find this animal from the waters of Western Australia. The ruby sea dragon is about 9 inches long, 24 centimetres, and was something of a real-life myth until it was formally described in 2015. The animal was first documented in 1919, but was misidentified as a common sea dragon. DNA sampling later revealed it to be the first new species of sea dragon discovered in 150 years. Experts say the red coloration helps these marine fish to stay hidden in deeper waters. Number 11. Red-Eyed Crocodile Skink Since they look like small crocodiles with large orange rings around their eyes, it's no wonder that these small lizards are in demand as exotic pets. They're endemic to the tropical rainforests of New Guinea and is said to freeze and play dead when they feel threatened. This one reminded us of a little toothless from the How to Train Your Dragon movies. What do you think? Number 10. Deep Sea Dragonfish He is a dragon with no scales, and its skin is slippery and slimy. Worthy of its namesake, this animal has a terrifying face and a mouth filled with huge teeth. Experts say the creature uses bioluminescence as a means of communication or to camouflage itself. The ability can also provide some light in the dark, cold waters of 6,000 feet or 1.8 kilometers below the surface. Prey is attracted by a glowing barbel or whisker that is used as a lure. This sounds like it would be a larger beast, but it only measures about 6 inches, 15 centimeters long. Number 9. Shocking Pink Dragon Millipede Research is founded in a limestone cave of Thailand, and it was formally described in 2007. Growing more than an inch long, 3 centimeters, it's one of the largest members of its genus. Along with that vivid pink coloration, experts say the creature gives off the aroma of almonds. That sounds pleasant enough, but the odor indicates the animal's lethal defense mechanism. It produces hydrogen cyanide to deter predators. That shocking pink color is how this dragon advertises its toxicity. Number 8. Central Bearded Dragon Their common name refers to the spiny guttural pouch that is located under the neck and chin area. The pouch or beard is inflated to express their superiority to others. The lizards will also use their pouch as a defense mechanism. By flattening their bodies against the ground, they will puff out their pouch and open their jaws. This behavior can scare off predators by making them appear larger. At about 24 inches long, 61 centimeters, their tail accounts for half of their body length. These are some of the more common dragons on the list since they're widely exhibited in zoos and are popular choices as pets. Typically found in semi-arid regions of Central Australia, they spend as much time in the trees as they do on the ground. Number 7. Black Spiny-Tailed Iguana 
This beast can be found from Mexico into South America, and it has also been introduced to the US. We thought it had a distinct dragon-like appearance. While it can't fly, this reptile has an ability that isn't usually linked with dragons. It can run really fast, at least for a lizard. Guinness has recorded its top running speed at 35 kilometers per hour, that's 22 miles per hour. Going about 1.3 meters long, 4.3 feet, and weighing about 10 pounds or 5 kilograms, that would make for a fearsome sight if they were chasing after you. That would be unusual though, since the reptiles typically employ their speed for escaping, not attacking. But they will bite and slash at predators with their tails. Did you know that most sources regard the black iguana as the world's fastest running lizard species? Number 6. Cave Dragons Unlike most of their kind, Ulm salamanders are amphibians that eat, sleep and reproduce underwater. They're endemic to the underground waters of caves located in central and southeastern Europe, Slovenia in particular. The creatures were first described in the late 17th century. After heavy rains, the Ulm were washed up from subterranean waters, and locals thought they were the offspring of a cave dragon, hence the nickname. Known for having lifespans of about 100 years, experts say that Ulms only mate about once every decade. Number 5. Dragonflies here are some dragons found on every continent except Antarctica. There are more than 3,000 living species of these insects, and they've been buzzing around for a long time. Their earliest fossils date back over 300 million years. The link between these critters and dragons is thought to have originated in Europe during the Middle Ages. Dragonflies can execute some amazing aerial maneuvers, and people of the time thought they were the spawn of the devil. They were wrongly accused of biting livestock and attacking the eyes and mouths of sleeping people. Did you know that the prehistoric ancestor of dragonflies had a wingspan exceeding 28 inches, 70 centimeters? At that immense size, they probably did resemble flying dragons. Number 4. Thorny Devil Dragon Native to central Australia, these lizards are coloured brown and tan to better camouflage themselves within their desert environment. Their bodies have sharp spines which discourage predators from eating them. The fearsome looking spikes cover the entire dorsal side of the critter's body, but it's not their only means of defence. In addition to the camouflage and armour, these beasts have a bundle of soft tissue located on the back of their neck. Whenever they feel threatened, the animal will lower its head and present the tissue, which appears like a second noggin. Predators are usually confused by the illusion of a two-headed lizard, and that allows the thorny devil to escape. Number 3. Frilled Dragon it's more commonly called a frilled lizard, and from its appearance, you could make a case for this reptile being either a real-life dragon or a real-life dinosaur. They're endemic to New Guinea and Australia, and get their common name, you guessed it, from the frill around their neck. It's normally kept folded against its body. Whenever the animal is frightened, the neck frill will suddenly spread out. Along with gaping its mouth open and raising its tail above its body, the display serves as a mean to scare off predators. At nearly 3 feet long, 85 centimetres, the animals are fairly large and are known to walk upright in a bipedal manner. When's the last time you saw a dragon do that? Number 2. Draco Lizards Dragons are often connected to sorcery and magic, and you could say that these small reptiles from the forests of Southeast Asia have some magical abilities. Thanks to wing-like membranes connected to their ribs, they can glide for more than 200 feet or 60 meters. While it's not self-powered flight, it's close enough that these animals are often called flying dragons. Including the tail, they measure about 8 inches long, 20 centimeters, so they wouldn't quite qualify for Game of Thrones. Did you know these critters are so good at camouflaging themselves that they're nearly invisible to predators? Number 1. Komodo Dragon This was an easy choice for number 1. Named for the island of Komodo in Indonesia, this beast is the world's largest extant species of lizard. They're known to grow some 10 feet long, 3 meters, and weigh more than 200 pounds, that's 91 kilograms according to Guinness. The largest specimen in the wild was verified at 366 pounds or 166 kilograms. Since they're so big, they dominate whatever ecosystem they're in. And unlike many reptiles, these animals demonstrate a group behavior when they hunt. Prey including larger mammals like wild pigs and deer can be knocked down by swinging their tail. The big lizards have also been known to attack humans on occasion, some of which have been fatal. 
While they don't breathe fire, they do have one inch long, two and a half centimeter serrated teeth. And there's evidence to suggest that the animals could be somewhat venomous, as if they weren't fearsome enough already. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit that big red subscribe button and click the bell for notifications for our next exciting episode right here on Epic Wildlife.